Good morning, folks. So we're back here at Ake's place. Sifo, homo, okay ah. And uh, I'm finally sending in the uh, wagon. I cannot tahan to see this anymore. I actually used duct tape to stem the uh, the um, spread of the rust. Look at the crack. I mean, this is really bad. That's never going to get better. It's just going to get worse. And I got to get this done before it eats through the bonnet. which is uh, which will be really really bad so yes dropping off one to pick up another there's so much stuff that needs to be done really this whole car is really really bad uh, you can see the bumper so I told him wherever is body color body color wherever is black whack it with a with a coat of black whack it with a coat of black so why am I here today in addition to dropping off the uh, the brick wagon the w123 uh, one two four, sorry, is ready. Absolutely ready. Absolutely ready. So wonderful, wonderful job as usual. He's given the uh, door handles and the wing mirror a nice coat of black. And the bumpers are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous now. Very, very good job, bro. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Chantek gila. Very, very nice as usual. So yeah, stay tuned for the uh, for what's gonna happen with the brick wagon. But as far as the one two four is concerned, it's beautiful. Yes, Evo represent. Really, really happy with this. Very nice result. Okay, so lots more to come. Yes, somebody was saying this car has no headrest, that's true. What I do have are two big ass speakers at the back here to act as a headrest. <laughs> that was a joke, yeah, very lame. So back to the original color, um, this is two-tone. Uh, actually, the bumper itself is two-tone and that's original. And now the body color. Cantik lah, Sipo. Thank you ah. Banyak cantik, banyak cantik. Right, so there she is. And yes, I actually already have a new bonnet emblem. As you can see, this one's a bit tarnished. But I already have a new one. So yeah, looking forward to getting that fitted. Yeah, so probably one of the worst parts or of the uh, brick wagon is that part of the roof which has actually come off. And uh, smoothening down the, uh, the rest of the roof is going to be quite interesting to get done. But uh, the car is running so well, so really really happy about that purring along like i said earlier there's like a tornado going on under the bonnet these old school uh, big radiator fans and there she is in daylight so lovely another thing is the turning circle of all mercedes benzes and even the brick wagon turning circle unbelievably good these old cars Quite amazing. Lovely. Yep, all three brake lights are working. Very good. So you take care, girl. Get well. I'm sure Ake is going to do a fantabulous job on you, as usual. All these small, small things. And this especially. It's getting worse. See, earlier it was just down here. And I covered it with the tape. But now it's already spreading. As you can see. Pretty soon it'll be this whole section will just delaminate. And so you gotta cut this out. And also the small, small little bits of bubble rust that are coming out. All this has to be taken care of. So I've not given him a time limit. I told him to take his time and do a good job as usual. The color is gonna be a bit of a surprise, so stay tuned for that. Okay, okay. Boleh bikin ah? John, thank you. Bucks. It's safe about 1000 plus. It should work out cheaper for me. 4000. 215. Even more. It's worth for 200 plus. 400 bucks of savings. Howdy, folks. Back again at my office. Yes, my office is inside there. Uh, Meng is fitting the new Bonnet Star 
for my W124 I mean look at that gorgeous so here's here's the old one in the uh, original box so good but just very very tarnished there it is Lovely. beautiful thank you thank you so much guys thank you and so the yeah it's all done really gorgeous very very happy with the result of the uh, paint job very nice oh yes and there's the alfetta uh, let's go have a very quick look I'll show you exactly what they've done the uh, they've taken on they had to drop the exhaust a bit as you can see just to get to the uh, drive shaft back there somewhere the donut or drive shaft coupling is uh, worn out too worn out so anyway in case you've never seen it here's a watts linkage this is a watts linkage it's a Dion rear suspension inboard disc brakes for better stopping stability very very cool I mean this is all mechanical technology that doesn't exist anymore yes I don't have any uh, brake discs here they're over here awesome really really awesome so yeah lovely looking good girl can't wait to drive you need to go for a drive and no they're not for sale <laughs> yes several people have actually emailed and offered whether they are well I want to sell these uh, Alfa Romeo Speedline wheels you see but no oh actually okay Ken uh, 30,000 comes with a free car <laughs> So that's just something really nice about driving along and seeing that three-pointed star up there on the bonnet. Something reassuring about that. I know it's weird. It's very weird. Oh, 300 CE. Check that out. That's nice. So yeah, these are the small, small little things. I mean, they're, they're weird. I know. Oh, 300 SEL and a Jimny. Bang. Good taste, good taste. So yeah, anyway, that's it. Yeah, basically. Just wanted to show you the new shiny, shiny bonnet star. The bonnet emblem of a Mercedes Benz. It's a weird thing, I know. But I love it. I absolutely love seeing this. Yes.